Ladies and gentlemen, the ranking member of the United States Senate's Committee on Commerce, Science and Transportation, and the senior senator from the state of Texas, the Honorable Kay Bailey Hutchison. We are honoring four brave, determined, resilient men. They and the astronauts who followed took enormous personal risks for our country to venture beyond Earth's orbit. Their missions into the unknown remind us of what can be achieved, as well as the dangers of not reaching for the stars. America urgently needs to continue our preeminence in manned space exploration. From Senator Glenn's flight on Friendship 7 to astronauts Armstrong, Collins, and Aldrin's lunar mission of Apollo 11, to our recent space shuttle program to the space station, we know that space exploration is a step-by-step -step process. It will require leadership to get a sustained commitment of resources and a clear sense of purpose over time. Look at what space exploration has brought to America. The technology and products in space science, earth science, fundamental aeronautics research, and education have spurred tens of billions of economic activity dollars and hundreds of thousands of productive jobs. The use of satellites that can guide a missile into a window from three miles away has drastically lowered collateral damage and saved countless lives in conflicts and wars. We have all heard the words of President John Kennedy when he spoke in 1962 at Rice University. For the eyes of the world now look into space, to the moon and to the planets beyond, and we have vowed that we shall not see it governed by a hostile flag of conquest, but by a banner of freedom and peace. The President set America on the course to achieve his vision. The men here today soared into a dark sky and described from afar what they saw. In the process, they contributed to a better world here on Earth. They assured America would lead the way. We owe it to them and to our nation not to abdicate our nation's role as the leader in space exploration. What they began, we are summoned to continue. Thank you.